right, this is Slider, and here's my review for Lego Creator Set number 7346, The Seaside House. It's uh, for ages 7 through 12, and it's 415 pieces. This set, for some reason, it kind of reminds me of uh, the set from the TV show Two and a Half Men. Do 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 men. Normally, this set is 50 bucks, um, but I got it for on the clearance at Walmart for uh, $35. Um, I think you can also get this set somewhere else, maybe now for $40. But uh, if you got a ghetto Walmart like I do, you can get this thing for $35 in the clearance section. All you do is call Walmart and say, hello, is this the ghetto Walmart? And if they answer with an attitude, it might be the ghetto Walmart. So try to save that money and get those deals. Okay, so here's the house. Here it is from this angle right here. You have uh, waves, which is pretty cool. I like the way that looks right there. Uh, you also have a little grill right there with a fish on top of it. You got this guy right there. He looks like uh, Max from the Lego Club. You have a uh, sand castle right there. The equipment attached to the house, you know, which looks like what the power meter and stuff like that. I may be wrong, so don't quote me on this. The door right here you can open it up there's no furniture in it the guy he just moved here I guess he's like I just got me a nice job and I want to show off by getting me a seaside house I do not have money for furniture though but at least I live in a nice area okay here's the back right over here you can lift that up like I said he has no furniture but he also, when he forgets his keys, though, he can just he, he can just use that and just be like, oh, let me crawl up here. Okay, there we go. Oh, man, I don't have any keys, but I don't need them. And that's the same thing criminals say, too, when they come to his house. They're like, let me just get in there. But there's no furniture, so it's nothing for them to steal. So that sucks. That would really be messed up if you robbed it, tried to rob this place and you end up going to jail and, and you find out there was nothing in there. Okay, so here's the other side with the little window there. And uh, you can also take the top off this house. Here we go. Bam, it removes just like that. And you can see inside of it. Like I said, no furniture. This is a nice, pretty nice place, though. And you can just attach it again right there. There you go. That's the seaside house. You also get this uh, little tree that comes with it. Well, you have to build it, of course, but it's a tree with a bird in there. For all you animal lovers. For spending 35 bucks on this set, I really like it. It was worth it. It's worth the buy. I mean, it's got some nice play features for children. It's a nice build. It's fun to build it. I wish some of this was tiled off, though. Like, I wish they had the flat tiles on the roof up here, as you can see, but they don't. Um, I might do that later on on my own. Though. I might tile it off better, so that way... If I ever have a Lego city, I can have this house like in a beach area and I can just, it can look kind of like similar to the modular houses with all the towels and stuff. So you don't have to, so that way you don't have all these studs showing up. It's nice when you got like no studs. I really like that look. So will I give this a buy? I would say yes. I would say, especially now, if you can get this set for like less than the retail price, you know what I mean? Because if I had to pay $50 for this, it would be... You know, it'd be a herder, you know, but like if you get this, get this for 35 bucks, you know, I feel like it's worth 35 bucks to get this. Um, it looks like this thing might be uh, retiring soon, too. So, you know, it'd be good to get this and have it, you know, maybe have an extra one, you know, just in case somebody else in the future decides they want one and you got one to, you know, sell them. But uh, I would say this house is a buy, especially now. And... Uh, so, if you liked my review of this set, subscribe below, uh, like it, share it, and I hope you enjoyed the video, and I will see you next time for another review. Alright, thanks. 
Alright, I want all your money and I want all your furniture. What?